Welcome to the long run. I'm Joel flying solo today. Chrissy's still a little under the weather. She kind of felt like her voice wasn't quite ready for a video yet. So you got me. Let's do this. We're going to be talking today about browser extensions and more specifically our favorite browser extensions, the one that we use the most uh, for the most cashback uh, and that they're, they're really, really, really fun and easy to use. And so let's kind of dive right in. I want to just name them first and then and then we'll go from there and talk about and talk about a little more in depth on these browser extensions. Now, we there are five that we really like to use a lot. Five. Um, the first one is Swagbucks. Uh, then we have Capital One Shopping. Then we have Ibotta, Honey, and Rakuten. And we're gonna I'm gonna share my screen with you, and we're going to kind of dive into uh what these um what they look like in your browser what they how they uh kind of integrate with with uh, what you're trying to do and um just kind of how they uh how, how they work and then how they give you the cash back um and so let's go here all right so if it, we use google chrome but most of them work the same way but you can tell right up here there's a little uh uh this is for browser extensions. That's the little icon for browser extensions. So if you click that, uh, it'll give you a list of the browser extensions that you have on there. Now, if you don't have them on there yet, you can come here to manage extensions uh, and you can go to each website uh, or you can search here. Like, so if you were to search here for, let's say, Ibotta, like that, then it's going to show me that it is, uh, it's already installed because it gives me the remove button. Uh, but if you don't have it installed, then you can, there'll be a button there to install it and it will install the extension for you. And so uh, that's how you get them on there, especially if you use Chrome. If you use anything else, then you might want to kind of uh, do a, a Google search and see if, uh, see if you can find out how to put those on there. But once you get them on there, then um, they start to, uh, they start to automatically work when you go to different websites. And so uh, we're going to look first at um, Capital One Shopping. We do this one. Uh, this one is integrated with, we have a Capital One uh, checking account, and this is uh, integrated with our, with, our, uh, with our debit cards. And so uh, Capital One Shopping there, anytime we go to Walmart or Sam's or anything like that, anything that we have clicked in there, then uh, we're able to um, get the cash back on the things that we're, that we're looking for so if you come here like say um uh, expedia there's some for walmart and uh, we already have some deals from that uh, if you don't have it linked in then you'll say get this deal you click that and then it'll give you the option to um to, to get those deals when uh when they when they pop up on your screen or when you buy something at that particular place um so you got all of these uh i got all these things here sam's club we got that let's see i can click that and see how that comes up and so sam's club will come up and then uh once you do your shopping then uh you'll be able to, to get the cash back on those so that's capital one shopping there and we get anywhere from one to three percent cash back uh you can say it'll show, show you here how much you can get back up to 27 percent on expedia um uh, up to three percent on sam's club um let's see up to 10% back at Walmart, things like that. Um, sometimes they have exclusive deals that you can do on uh, certain items, uh, and then uh, you can get the cash back on those. So that's Capital One Shopping. Uh, the next one we're going to look at is Ibotta, which is probably probably the one we use the most. Um, and so whenever you go to a site that has uh, Ibotta with it, you'll start to see here, um, so if you want to use it at CVS like that, uh, eBay, uh, there's some recommended offers there that you can use. Um, you can get cash back from also from Walmart if you shop there. So if I were to go here to, to Walmart, uh, and I just click shop, then it's going to pop up on the, on the right hand side here. Maybe it's not this time because it's already there. But usually when I go, there it goes, uh, up to 5%. Uh, I, I actually, they're all popping up right now. So this is a good thing. <laughs> so when we go to Walmart, uh, our Rakuten app, app, app pops up. 
Uh, the um, Ibotta app pops up, and then also the swag bugs. You can see that behind there going as well. Uh, but you can only use one at a time. That's the that's the that's the drawback to it. Is once you choose one, then um, if you choose another one, then it, it will sometimes uh, deactivate the one you've already used. So if I wanted to use Rakuten now, um, it might um, deactivate the one that I just set up with um, uh, with Ibotta. So d just make sure once you're doing those, make sure. If, uh, if you're using one, if you're trying to use two and it kind of deactivates one, then just know that may happen. Uh, so there's Rakuten just come up up to 2% cashback activated. So you can click that off. Um, see, my bottom went off and now it's saying click to activate. And we'll see if we can activate both of those. Okay. Let's see. It's going to reset now. And now I've got Rakuten act activated. And let's see. Okay, maybe they're both going, but we'll see. And there's honey right there. We're going to talk about that one in a minute. Um, actually, let's go ahead and talk about it now because it's already popping up. Uh, but there on Walmart, it'll search for, uh, honey will search for the best prices. Uh, it'll also um, give you cash back here. Uh, is this is 0.1% to 1% cash back at Walmart. Uh, if you can, you can up activate that. Um, let's see if I can activate all of them. Let's see. All right, so they're um, it's resetting the website again. And then they'll pop up here on, your, on the side, and you'll, you, you'll be able to see which ones are activated once they come in there. Yep, there's one for, uh, let's see, nope, that one's still not. That's what we got here. That's the Ibotta. That's the Honey Cashback activated there. You can see the Ibotta is still not activated it is it's got the check mark by it so maybe you can't activate them uh, more than one at a time but um i've also got uh Rakuten here as well looks like it's i activate that one you know reset your website but you can see once i activated i bought a, this one deactivated and now i'm having to activate it again so just be aware of that. You may only be able to use one. We may not be able to double dip. That's what I'm trying to say. And uh, and get cash back on several at one time. So there's Rakuten is activated. And now it's asking me to act, click to activate Ibotta. So just be aware of that. You may not be able to use uh, more than one at a time. Um, and so once you go in and you do your shopping, then you'll get an email saying, hey, you've activated this uh, rebate. And then you'll get it back um uh over uh, a few days time it'll come back and it'll be in in your account and so here let's see you get your offers there and then you can go to your account and um see how much cash back you actually have in there and and then let's see Looks like Honey is activated as well as Rakuten. So you may be able to use both of those at the same time. But just like I said, just be aware that uh, some of them may deactivate uh, if you use one, if you're trying to use more than one. Um, and so then we've got the swag button down here, which is for swag bucks. You can activate 15% uh, cash back there. Um, and you earn 15 swag bucks per dollar spent on these. See if we shop there. Let's see if it deactivates anything else when it pops back up. Okay, so we've got the swag books activated. The Rakuten, the Rakuten deactivated once we put on the swag bucks. So, like I said, be aware of that because um, it will it will do that. And so, once you go to a website and you activate your cash back, then you shop on the website, and then it gives you the cash back after that. And we use this for for a lot of different things. Um, we use this for a lot of a lot of different things. 
Uh, we use it, we save up the money, we use it for shopping, we use it for um, several other things. Um, we use it for, for we use, when we do Christmas gifts, uh, we use the cash back for that. Uh, but we save it up a lot and then we kind of cash it in towards the end of the year and we use it for different things. So I hope that answers some of your questions about browser extensions, how to use them and uh, what we use them for and the, the, the cash back that we use them for as well. Um, put some, drop me some comments below. Let me know what your favorite browser extensions are. Maybe it's something different than what we use. Maybe it's something that, that maybe we'd like to start using or maybe some of our other viewers would like to uh, start using as well. But dro drop us those comments below and uh, let us know uh, what your favorite browser extensions are and then how you use the cashback. We'd love to hear that. I'd love to hear how you're supplementing your income with, uh, with cashback from the browser extensions. If you don't use browser extensions, maybe this is the time to start and uh, start getting some cashback on uh, some of the shopping that you're already doing. If you're already going to do some shopping online, you might as well get some cashback for it activate those browser extensions and um and uh, start uh start rolling in the cash back yeah um but i'm gonna put a video up right here that you can click that's we say the thing we always say that's gonna do it today for the long run i'm joel flying solo today and don't forget it's a long run give yourself a little grace